very special comparison today. We got the beloved Glock 19 Gen 5. The very hot press 6 hour P320 X5. X5. It's a big pistol, but it's light. You know? And of course, it's the infamous uh, CZ Shadow 2. All right. Single action only. Slight take up, but kind of very spongy, okay? It's not easy. The trigger is pretty strong. When I mean strong, it's pretty good. Not hard trigger, maybe three pounds, three and a half. I think it's three and a half. X5 the cut here on the slide to me it doesn't make any difference doesn't make it recoil you any easier just so you know okay so it's more like a gimmick flat trigger this trigger is awful it's not very good you see it's very greeny grainy you hit the wall and then it's kind of how do I say it? it's plasticky it's like toy gun anyway it's not a good trigger I'm sorry six hour and as you can see uh, this is seven yard outdoor so Glock actually did better than that so if you are thinking about getting a six hour piece return the x5 I think Gen 5, 19 would beat it. Last one is the Shadow 2. This is one heavy pistol, very heavy, very heavy. And because the barrel doesn't move, that's why you got this very strong concentration here, guy. You know, there's no argument. I'm not saying Glock 19, Gen 5 will outshoot Shadow 2. See, the concentration is larger group. Here, absolutely one whole tight group. But it's heavy though, you know. So you have to prepare, you know, if you want to, are you ready to have a heavy gun like that? This one is lighter, lighter, but... Uh, uh, Somehow, out of the three, this is my least favorite and the least accurate, the results show it. So overall, Shadow 2 come in at first, then Glock 19 Gen 5, the last one is the 6 hour P320 X5. By the way, this one doesn't have a recess barrel. This one, you see that? It's a recess barrel. That's good. And how about Glock 19 Gen 5? This one has a recess barrel as well. So, recess barrel make it more accurate. It's just physics, okay? No argument on that. This one doesn't have a recess barrel, but uh, because of the fixed barrel and uh, the trigger and the weight and of course the ergonomics, just make it an extremely accurate handgun. 
the site is kind of high so but you know it's we are shooting at seven yards so we are not going to touch that just look at the concentration all right so overall i would say you know yes Shiro 2 is uh, famous for its for the reason Clock 19 Gen 5 of course you cannot go wrong with it P320 X5 is the 6 hour Mark T machine all right Flat trigger looks nice, but the mechanics of it sucks. This one, I wonder if you put a flat trigger in here would make it even more accurate. But I mean, how more accurate can you go with that, you know? So, just a comparison some food for salt for you to consider absolutely a blast to shoot look at that one heck of a heavy handgun look at all those steel man look at all the steel here Massive, massive. What a nice machine. Okay, I hope you enjoyed July 4th. Have fun out there, be safe. See you. Ah,
Ja.